Hi there. Oh, that looks good. Oh, that's a little awkward. Life seems full of awkward moments lately, doesn't it? Our bodies are going through some changes right now, and that comes with some pretty awesome stuff. But also maybe some, uh... Oof. <coughs> Aww. Hmm. Do you want to talk about it? It's okay. I know it feels kind of awkward right now. Let's start small. What's on your mind? Really? You know, I went through something similar when I was your age. It was really scary for me at first, too. Who did I talk to? Oh, an adult I trusted. You know something? Learning about our changing bodies can kind of be, oh, I don't know, kind of exciting. There's so much about our gender, sexuality, reproductive organs, and relationships to learn about. Some of this stuff you can discover on your own with friends, but some of it you'll want to learn with a parent or a grown-up you trust too. I know it can feel like an invasion of privacy and that it's embarrassing. It can be a really hard thing to talk about with the grown-ups in our lives. A lot of times it probably seems easier to just avoid these conversations, doesn't it? Why ask a grown-up a question if you can just Google it, right? But that can be dangerous. The internet is full of misinformation. Just because someone on a forum sounds like they know what they're talking about, doesn't mean they actually do. Sometimes it might feel like there's nobody you can talk to. Unfortunately, in some cases, the people who should be there for you aren't or won't have this conversation with you. It can be hard for adults to know what to say, so don't be discouraged. Not all adults are like this. If you feel you can't talk to your parents or caregivers, don't give up. There are many other caring adults who want to help. Just keep looking until you can find a trusted grown-up you can talk with. They are all around you, even if at times it may not feel that way. So, how do we break through the awkwardness barrier and get up the courage to talk to people about the things that we're scared of? Let's start with location. Picking a good spot, somewhere you're both facing forward, helps. Don't feel the pressure to learn everything in one sitting. There are a lot of books you can read to get a head start on your conversation. You won't learn everything in a day. I'm still learning, and I'm the narrator. If you're not sure what to say or how to start, try asking a specific question like, If I use a tampon, do I really lose my virginity like my friend said? My friend said that you can't get pregnant when you're on your period. Is that true? What is Planned Parenthood? <laughs> Wait, our butts are the biggest muscle in our body? What? I'm curious. Let's stay on topic. Speaking of which, there are lots of different subjects to explore. While you should definitely speak to an adult about it, you can always start here at amaze.org. It's never too early to start learning about your body. And you should never be embarrassed to learn more when you're older, too. Thank you so much for watching this video. Make sure to check out our other videos as well. And remember, you're amazing.